so what we're gonna do first inside of that is we're going to get uh, this data URL that we just set on the link that's what we're going to get so we say URL equal to um, actually let's just say data URL equal to um, this and this in this case just means the li tag that we actually have clicked on currently so this dot um, um say attribute sorry and uh, what attribute do we want to get we want to get data url attribute that we just set on the li tag so we've got a data attribute so what do you want to do we want to just call load post okay and we want to pass it data url All right, so that seems to be it. Let's go down here and just do one more thing. Since when the page load, we want to first call the load post by default without the user having to click. So we just pass that with an empty string. And just one more thing, guys. Since we've created uh, the link over here, what we want to do is, is we want to just set the text of it to the number that is currently being iterated so text we give it an index and then we want to append it to page links append to page links and page links is up here so we just copy that and paste it okay everything seems to be all right so let's just do one quick glance and see that everything is fine and yeah everything seems to be all right so let's go back in our Firefox page and try to load this and see what happens. So instead of Ajax, we're going to have to load index.php. So let's load this and it says loading. And nothing happens. So probably we've had an error. So let's go in our console and see what happens. All right, if type of URL equal to undefined, missing says I'm missing a closing thing here so let's go ahead in our um, PHP and have a look at that all right if type of URL equal to oh so it should have been a type of sorry about that guys all right um, refresh and we still have an error missing after property ID huh Interesting. Missing colon. All right, let's go and just fix that. Seems like it doesn't like this um, dash that I put there. So we'll just put a data URL, copy that, and instead of data dash URL, we'll just do this. Okay, so we we'll refresh. As you can see, the page is loading and nothing comes back it's a bit strange okay let's go ahead and see what happened so apparently it seems like um, I'm not appending that the data that comes into the um, HTML so what do we want to do hmm. Oh, okay guys, sorry about that. Um, here, instead of um, setting the post div to empty, we want to actually give it data. Sorry, results string. Okay, sorry about that guys, that's 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 my fault. Um, I probably should have been paying more attention, all right? So this resulting string over here has the, um, has the list of posts that, we, that was generated from the um, underscores template that we have over here so when we have when underscore generates all the posts we want to append that over here so basically that's what we're doing here this is what underscore returns and we just append that to uh, set it as the HTML for the post there. okay so let's go back here seems to we bring in data but it's not appending it so we refresh and it's loading 
when it's done it's supposed to do that but it's not doing it let's see one more time okay let's see what's happening post.html resulting string okay what's happening hmm all right bit of debugging to do <laughs> seems <laughs> always fun <laughs> 